finally here. It's race day here at Spokane County, and I'm really excited to get in this car and see what we can do tonight. I've been wearing out my crew chief Dwayne, his cell phone, and his email in this entire week, going over shots and different things that we can do to make the car better. And I'm really excited to get out there and show what I can do with this equipment, and now it's time to qualify. Alright, I guess it's time to go racing and see what this can do. We had a pretty good practice session earlier today. We got it dialed in, we made a few uh, big changes right before we're going out so we can get some more speed out of this thing. It's been so fun seeing the, the enthusiasm in Patrick's eyes. You know, we could not wait to get here, and ever since he's been here, he's been um, just, just so positive. And I think that that's what I appreciate the most, is he did an amazing job winning our competition. Over 700 entries, narrowed it down to 10, and all the way down to Patrick winning. So obviously he's very talented, he's thankful for this opportunity, and that means a lot to me, that he uh, appreciates what Peak, uh, Motor Oil and all the sponsors that uh, Toyota and Michael Walter Racing put together for him to have this chance. Just be real important to try to figure out how to keep the tires under him and run a smart 150 laps. Well here we are, we're ready to take the green flag at the Toyota Napa Auto Parts 150. Patrick's got his big shot, he's excited, had some great practicing, qualified well. Looking forward to a big night from Patrick. In the peak Toyota out of Plantation, Florida, the 99 is Patrick. Dora Chill starting to set in. Can't wait to get ready to go here. First NASCAR race and we'll see what happens when we go green in this thing. It's an honor to be out here driving Bill McNally's car, Peak Motor Oil, Blue Death. I gotta thank both of them for getting me here. Peak Stock Car Dream Challenge, uh, Brian Emmerich, Michael Waltrip, Ty Norris, they all saw something in me and I think I came out to here, here tonight and did a pretty good audition. Uh, also gotta say hi to my mom back home because uh, sorry she can't be out here, but I know she'd be loving to see this right now. So this is a great, awesome first run. I can't wait to get back out here. I think what this shows you with Patrick's you know, top five finish and the way he drove and the way he competed in this series, this Stock Car Dreams Challenge was legitimate. For him to get out there and do what he did and move up from P7 to P5 and battle for P4 and P3 throughout the night, I mean, it was unbelievable. Everybody share in next year's contest because you never know what could happen. They come out here and run top five in the first K&N West race. So I'm just, I mean, I'm so psyched right now. It's incredible.